the weather, whether we like it or not. Give a scream for you and me about a constitution that says all are free. Where is the equality? Where is the reality? Having to be what we are not. Fighting for jobs someone else has got. Thanks, America. Thanks a lot for an economy. For an economy! <laughs> that I think will be the death of you and me. We've all worked here in this land, bucket on floor, mop in hand, bowing and scraping and saying yes sir, saying yes ma'am, teachers sweatshops, technos, medicos, laymen's, waiting at the bus stops, hold your bag tight, watch out for the next tax rip off. Did a little piecework in one hour, made 15.99. WTO hired a country shit. They cut my time. <laughs> weather the weather be fine. <laughs> weather the weather be not. We'll weather the weather, whatever the weather, whether we like it or not. Whether we like it or not. Whether we like it or not. <laughs> okay. All right. My name is Verna Hampton. I go by Sister FM Diva. And people ask me this question, and then I'm going to get off the podium. Where do I come from? I come from Africa. I come from Boston. I come from Brooklyn. I come from displaced Africans, brought here on ships and sold to a man named Yops. I also come from Yops. <laughs> I come from Tobe, Alvarine, Zula, Big Red, Elaine, a light-skinned Pullman porter, and a dark-skinned Navy man. I come from a mama who was very hanked her, very sedid here, but she could get down to the do wa <laughs> And y'all know what I'm talking about. I come from a mother who told me you are a princess and nuns who called me you people I come from my guts I come from my heart I come from St. John St. Anne St. Hughes and the Blessed Sacrament Convent for Negroes and Indians <laughs> I come from down south Georgia and up south Massachusetts Louise Day Hicks and Lester Maddox Sardis Vidalia Savannah Valdosta Roxbury Dorchester Mattapan I come from fried chicken collard greens and potato salad five dollars a plate the Odessa and Leshko's on Avenue A, pierogies, blintzes, and real mashed potatoes, Papa Leroy's home-cooked Navy meals, and Granny Wright's cakes, mm, made from scratch. I come from Cocovan, lasagna, bagel, steak, salad, baked beans, corn on the cob, lobsters, hogmars, chicken and fried fish on Fridays. I come from hallelujah, shalom, thank you, Jesus, and Allah, Akbar. I come from Patricia Flannery, Richard Morowski, Constance Zabella, old Eastern European men sitting in the Bialystoke Deli on Blue Hill Ave drinking tea from a glass, and Zelda's mother, who had numbers on her arms, I come from my guts, I come from my heart, I come from we shall overcome. Free breakfast for children, busting the Honorable Elijah Muhammad, JFK, Fred Hampton, Malcolm X, Martin Luther King, and up against the wall, motherfucker. <laughs> I come from if you take the A train, or the J train, or the one, two, three, the four tops, Aretha, the Temptations, the 1812, Overture, ooh, baby, baby, there's a party tonight. It's howdy duty time. Turn that music down. And Nina Simone, I wish you knew how it would feel to be me. And everybody knows about Mississippi. God damn. I come from Catherine Dunham, Maria Tallchief, Hattie McDaniels, Paul Robeson, Dorothy Dandridge, Nikki Giovanni, Susan Batson, Marvin Felix Camillo, Pancho, Robbie McCauley, Dr. Barry Harris. I come from Steppen Fetch It. That's right. I come from Steppen. I come from my guts. I come from my heart. Where do I come from? Hey, I come from you. Peace. Raj Kamdar. Haiku, Pax Americana. Typewriter rainstorm, pregnant fingers fall heavy, rainwater runoff. Polyurethane, the sounds of Bedford rush hour, skateboard Satori. East Harlem sirens, Odyssean salvation, scatter the vagrants. 
In the wake of nights spent philandering with your girl, I feel hollow. Teetering nightlife, we were sad and desperate and angry, faithless. Romance has crushed me. Here in withdrawal, my hands shake and your mouth is like wine. Sewer smoke tumbles tendrils across evacuated side stone cobble streets. What might have been yours now belongs to someone else. Feelings all that's left. Recently I put together my, my rules for writing. So this is called rules for writing. <laughs> or perhaps rules for those living to write. Be the hero in your story of your own life. The narrative will write itself full of happy accidents. Share your shittiest shit with everyone. Be proud of your glorious turd. <laughs> Live wildly while you're young. Work hard through your middle age. And strive to die holy, ragged, and unknown. It's what Sid would have wanted for you. Just write to write. And when you're tired or frustrated by it, remember the horrible romance of what you're suffering. The ticking of little godheads crushed underfoot every fucking time. Fear nothing. Allow everything to consume you and vomit you back up and you'll find you're intact. Howling at the mood, man, is better than nostalgia. This life is your victory lap. Forget what you just pulled off. Be here and now in that empty wake. Uncle Walt had it right. Father Jack did it right. Pop, pop, pop like fabulous yellow Roman candles. Have faith in grand gestures. They're few and far in between in the stuff of art and life. Be there to live them and share them with others so we can all have hope. Go everywhere. Try everything. The mantra, will this be a good story in the morning, has served me very well. He who dies with the best stories wins. And remember, lepers are saints and tomcats are always at home. See things for what they are, and by all means, get very excited for a period of time. Poetry is lovely, but strive to speak simply and live plainly. Best not to hope or expect that anyone should understand your beautiful, guttural bark. You don't need to show them. Show yourself. Musicians and painters will always be strange but commensurate uh, bedfellows. Just remember, you're all running different races. Try not to confuse yourself with each other. Love your woman. Love your family. Love your friends. But in the end, love yourself. Bury your heroes in unmarked graves, unadorned. You'll never forget where you left them. The tired push of the loner belongs to him alone. Loan's always just fine. Run with it. Recognize where you are when you're there. You get to have it. Share it with others. Finding new people helps you find yourself. Don't say it, write it. Excitement and thoughtless talking is a mistake. Take it home with you. Not that I do that, but I'm a hack. Burn, baby, burn. <laughs>